As poor Pride's career rather fell apart, Nicholson went on from strength to strength, always experimenting, always trying to paint in new and interesting ways. Um, and one of the ways in which uh, he really pushed forward was his exploration of light. Um, whether he was painting a still life, like a pewter, um, or whether he was painting from nature outdoors, um, he was always sensitive to the extraordinary way in which light fell on surfaces, and on different surfaces, whether metal or old plaster of a building. Another marvellous painting of light is actually a night scene. Um, it's one of the great masterpieces in the collection here at Fitzwilliam. It's William Nicholson's painting of Armistice Night. And we know that Nicholson, like half London, went out onto the streets, uh, mad celebrations at the 11th hour, and he painted a scene as soon as he got home, recording the strange celebration with flares of light. Uh, but we know that he didn't actually feel quite so celebratory as many. His son had been killed in the last days of the war. And we see he painted two wounded soldiers um, there as a sort of memento mori in this otherwise wild scene of London celebrating the armistice. <laughs> 